Alrighty, so after the absolute chaos that was the Marine Ford War, the War of the Best, we're getting some coziness with Luffy and Ace's kids. Welcome back to the channel. We have episodes 494 and 495 of our One Piece watch through today. And yes, we're getting some more backstory on Luffy and Ace and how they met and how Ace was really kind of cold to Luffy at first. I mean, he chases him out day after day after day, getting these cuts and scrapes and bruises, just trying to hang out with them. But at the end of the last one, Luffy stumbled upon what looks like just like wreckage. I don't really know. So I guess we'll see what that loose end ends up being. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to drop a sub and let's hop into it. Where even is this? Oh. Oh, wait. I think this is what Luffy stumbled upon. It just looks like a bunch of wreck. It's like a junkyard. He's about to yoink what they got. Mm. Yeah, this is a junkyard. This is like, what's it called? Meteor City from Hunter x Hunter? Dang, dude. Gray terminal. terminal. Gray terminal. I guess I never even like considered what else could be a part of the island that Luffy grew up on. And Ace to attack those two dudes. Luffy for real think he gonna call back to him after all this. Just beating up these grown man, grown men. Thieves! Well, I guess it's jewelry. Anything of remote value. So they find stuff, take it to the city and cash it in? Yeah, you keep that a secret, bro. I wouldn't be celebrating. That guy look kind of creepy. Oh no. Oh no, Luffy. Oh, he's so tiny compared to you. Luffy just look like an ant. He's just looking for A's. There he is. Yoink their stuff and ran. Forest in between. Sabo. Sabo, Iruka. Sabo. Is that another child? Is that Naruto's voice actor? Oh my god, I'm not gonna unhear it if it is. Dude, it totally is. Sabo. Didn't Luffy... Either Luffy or Ace has said Sabo. Like when Ace was dying. Oh my god! Dude, this kid is kind of drippy. Look at him! Top hat? Goggles? Holy! Just in a tree. Oh no, he heard the plan! <laughs> He's like Ace's annoying little sibling that just overheard his master plan. Oh no. Abandoned ship! Dude, it's really hard to not hear Naruto, bro. Oh, and now they have to kill Luffy since he knows the secret. They just tied him around the tree! They both have metal poles, too. Ah. Does this kid also just not have a family? Dang, they really do have to kill him. Feels bad. That's tough, man. Oh my god, they're really about it, too! What did you think his reaction to saying, we're gonna kill you, would be? <laughs> That's all they have to do. Yeah, just throw him in some water. He said, definitely don't kill me that way. It would be way too easy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Just run. I don't think they're going to find that treasure, bro. That's pretty That's pretty hidden away. Oh, Ace and Sebo made like a name for themselves. The Blue Jam Pirates. These two kids just run rampant, take money from people. Oh, Captain Blue Jam be pissed. Oh my god! Nah, he kind of looks like the type. He looks a little unhinged. Luffy's gonna do something. Oh no. How? How so quickly? He is just a little worm, bro. <laughs> and now he knows he can, he can use him as a hostage. God dang, Luffy. He is like the, the embarrassing little sibling, man. Now the question is, are they going to fight for him? <laughs> nah, he's not gonna he's not gonna tell. This is the moment where Ace realized Luffy's a real one and can, he can keep him around. Because he's gonna say no, right? Surely Luffy. 
Is he pointing at them? No way! Oh, okay. Well, at least he lied. I thought he was pointing like that direction at first, but hey, I think that, like I said, I think Ace is gonna see this. They're gonna step in. Oh, maybe not. Or this is how Luffy and Ace saw each other for the last time before they were split up. Dude, he's got coattails too. The money. That's a good spot, man. Oh no, he's a hostage. Oh my god, what are you gonna do with the hammer, brother? Bro! Oh, but he's right. He's not even gonna realize that it won't even matter. Oh my god. This guy's a madman. He was ready to do that to a child. What? What? A pair of gloves for what, bro? Just abandoning ship. Five years? Is that how long they've known each other? Oh my gosh. Oh my god, there's spikes. Oh, because the spikes would actually like impale him. Oh no. This guy is psychotic. Oh my God. The child is a punching bag. Yeah, if this guy's this brutal, I don't even want to know what Blue Jam is like. And he doesn't tell. Oh, he's not telling him. God dang, if only they knew. Poor Luffy, he's like, he's so just calm and collected because he can't get hurt, but until it starts to hurt. Why is he got a, a doll like that? Now are they actually gonna plot a rescue mission? Ah, they realize he hasn't squealed. They didn't even need to dip. Their new spot. Aw. He's like, oh man, but that kid's dead. There's a lot more to their childhood than I thought. And this Savo kid, I don't think they've ever mentioned. Aside from, like I said, I think they name dropped him one time. I need to go back and see what the line is in retrospect, though. Yep. Yep. This is the turning point, dude. Loki, I feel like Ace is going to go tell the Don and all of them. <gasps> Blue Jam! Ooh. He is kind of intimidating. Kind of creepy. He do look like a captain, though. He's just laying into him! This is so messed up, bro. It's like unconscious. Let alone talk. So sad. Dang. Even they say it's too far. Does he have a 69 tattooed on his arm? Who is the sheriff? Oh, they don't come out to the gray terminal. Just torturing a child in there. Oh, money to the nobles. Oh my gosh. Even if it's a child. Uh, if he hadn't by now, he's not going to. God dang, dude. Luffy a real one. Oh no. He's gonna just pop. Oh. oh. I thought he was gonna lay into him. Oh no. Oh, he wants to kill him. All right, who steps in? Uh, I feel like they, they were going to make it back. Or does Luffy die here in a flashback? She knew. Well, who stepped in? Well, we're probably going back like 15 seconds and they're going to come like crashing through. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go. The rescue squad. Yeah! Oh, that's actually so sweet. They came for him. But like I said, I feel like that's the turning point because now Ace is like, okay, this Luffy kid ain't that bad. But I can't, the, the Sabo, the, this is so random. And especially seeing as it seems like he's very, 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 very close to Ace. So this begs the question, is this Sabo kid still alive? And where is he now? And why has he never been mentioned before? 495, let's go. Nani. He's like... <laughs> This child! Oh, shoot! 
Let's go, Sabo! Woo, he clean with it. Dude, I cannot get over his fit, man. The top hat and everything. The, the blue, it's beautiful. Yeah, this guy's gotta be infinitely stronger than them. They're children. Oh. Doesn't seem like the Sabo kid has a double fruit either. I don't think. I probably would have been revealed by this point. This is a pretty dire situation. <gasps> He's staying behind. Damn. She could chat even against this giant. I mean, inherently, they have the same plan. They want to be pirates, too. <laughs> it's pretty brave, though, man. Listen, he's a giant. He has to look like a monster to them. They're so small. And Sabo's there to back him up. Starting to see where Luffy got his uh, will to never give up. Aside from the fact that he already kind of was like that, chasing after his... They beat him? Oh, my God. Lost to children. Oh, Blue Jam's gonna kill this guy, yeah. No chance. He said Blue Jam was ruthless. Damn, double tap too, Blue Jam? Look, I really thought he was gonna go get the Dawn and all those guys. Oh, Kinda what Luffy sounds like right now. Yeah, but he's getting stronger because he faces everybody. They aren't even pirates and they have a, 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 a pirate like group after them, a crew. Mm. He, he shut that down fast. He wants to do whatever Ace tells him. That's what friends do. Because he respects you, Ace. Because he thinks you're cool. Hmm. Is it like Ace seeing that he has a purpose in this kid's life? Like, to Luffy? Like, he wouldn't be better off then? Oh my god. But Ace isn't even alone. He's had Sabo for like five years, apparently. Is he spoiled? He's just a little... A little kooky. <laughs> I'm only seven! Bro got tortured! Bag! <laughs> and so it begins! Right? Gotta look out for each other. So, Sabo just lives out in the woods alone? You're gonna die? <laughs> just ask the Dawn if another child can live in the house? <laughs> I mean, what else would they do besides, like, relocate where he's, like, where he stays? We're all messed up. Oh, he is with them. Oh my gosh. Was that the favor? But like, where is this? Why did a child just wander in? They're multiplying. The Don was already sick of two of them. Now there's three. Was he supposed to stay hidden? Like that was their plan? No shot, man. They didn't even hide the hat or anything. Come on, the Don. Put it together. Who else? She's heard his name? How has she heard of him? He's a child. Oh. Well, I guess those pirates had, had known about Ace and Sabo too. Like they caused a little bit of chaos in uh, Great Terminal. Oh my god! Can't refuse a request. Oh my gosh. I'm not a gender <laughs> Bro's talk no truth doing his way in. Trust the process. Oh my gosh, he's not turning him down. Oh my gosh. I mean, look at that kid's smile. Actually scamazed his way in. These two kids are way too ahead of their time in terms of their age. They're too advanced. Aww. And now Luffy's like gonna be with, with Ace. He's gonna keep up with him, I think. I think their, their bond is kind of growing. I wonder where the, the Dawn is these days. If she's just even alive in the other two. What a casual warning! This pirate group might just swing by and murder you all. I don't know, the Dawn seems pretty strong, I'm not gonna lie. She can take him. We're gonna come back and the entire house is just gonna be dead. 
<laughs> Look, Luffy's. Oh, wait. He's falling a tiny bit behind. I'm actually shocked he's keeping up with him considering he was tortured for hours on end. And Sabo's a lot nicer to Luffy, like a lot, a lot more opening to him, a lot warmer to him. I have a bad feeling something very tragic happens to this child. Aww. There he is, big fish. He's like a dog over there. He's literally a dog, bro. They gave him the tail. Oh, no. Th this is going to be so tragic, man. Sabo's so nice. A lot of unbeatable attacks. <laughs> so intrigued by him. Mm -hmm. Let's see what he came up with. <laughs> Anna! Ace can't see it. He's baiting him in, bro. That reverse psychology. <laughs> Ace is gonna peek over. I guarantee it. This kid's uh, curiosity. There's no way he doesn't. You gotta see the application, Sabo. No! They're using him as a soccer ball, man. This is so mean. Leave him alone, man. No! Oh, my. Oh, damn. Rip. Oh, my God! Just spit that out! Oh, my goodness. He missed this alligator crocodile messing with the wrong kids. The absolute worst kids. Let's go. This is such a cute dynamic between the three of them. Luffy's, like I said, like the annoying, loud, younger one. Sabo's like the, just like a, a little bit warmer than Ace, but it balances out. Check something. <laughs> oh no. Wait, what? Wait, how did they even like catch a whiff that it was in a tree like that? Oh my gosh. Oh, he wants to stay with them. They're like the, the two mature ones. They're literally just looking for these three children. <laughs> Why are they even stacked, bro? They literally just wanted an excuse to sit on Luffy, man. Just make him make him work for them. <laughs> Even the Don. Oh my god. I feel like something something either happened to the Don family or Sabo. Or both. Like I said, neither have been mentioned. I feel like for a reason. You fight. Oh my god. Yeah. I thought it was going to just be like a war between the Dadan family and the Blue Jam Pirates. My goodness. Genius. Rehearsal. <laughs> they lie exactly like Luffy. We're screwed. And they bring food. Tidings. Maybe she'll see how uh, how effective they all are together and find use more use out of them. She already has use out of Ace. He brings them food. Yeah. Fuck, what a bond. This is the bond that I thought was just between Luffy and Ace. Game another wrong game. This is so fascinating to me, because like I said, up until this point, I just pictured a... I mean, all we've seen is a childhood of, of Luffy and Ace and how close they were. This this third kid wasn't ever mentioned, and seemingly he was around for a while. Like I said, five years before this with Ace, and as the, the episode ended, it was just like, yeah, they started to have these adventures together and fighting these animals. So I think the best... Uh, the chances right now are that something very tragic happens to him, because where would he be now? We I feel like if we would have been mentioned up until this point aside from in passing like i said something was said about a sabo in marine ford i think when ace was dying i think he said his name i'd have to go back to see exactly what he said about him but he's been brought up one time before and that was the only time but it, it seems like it, it was the exact same dynamic between luffy and ace that it, the sabo has with ace too so i don't know maybe i need to start like reevaluating what i know about ace and luffy and ace's relationship and how the, this other kid there was there was a good group of three friends instead but guys that's been it for episode 494 495 of our one piece watcher we are learning quite a bit of our mc's childhood if you're new to the channel don't forget to drop a sub and i'll catch you in the next one peace peace